Good afternoon, YouTubers. Today I'm going to show you a 2014 Honda Accord EXL V6 with navigation in the hematite metallic color with black leather interior. This car was redesigned last year for the 2013 model. So for 14, everything carries over. So what is included in this package is, we'll start with the key for today. You got the smart entry system with the push button start. Leather interior with perforated seats. See if you can see that. There you go. Got power seat with power lumbar support. Power windows and locks, power outside mirrors. You got memory seats. You've got the wood grain interior. Over here, on this model, you get the lane departure warning. So if you switch lanes without using your turn signal, the car will know, it'll notify you and tell you it's time to turn on the blinker or wake up, you're falling asleep at the wheel. There's a traction control button, your econ button, your tire pressure reset button, start the car up. You know what, I'm going to do this again, I'm going to show you guys something. See that light right there? That's the light that comes on when this system's activated. Either the LDW system or the forward collision warning system, which is located here. If the car senses you're gonna rear in the car in front of you, it'll notify you by blinking the lights and uh, doing the little beeping sound. It's just basically telling you that it's time to hit the brakes. The car won't do it on its own, so you, you have to make sure that you're paying attention when you're driving. Well, you probably already knew that, right? So that's what the instrument panel looks like. You've got all sorts of information there. No. So it's going to show you your range, your average miles per gallon, trip one, trip B, trip A and B. Oil life monitor system, obviously this car is brand new, so it's showing 100% right now. The steering wheel is leather wrapped. You've got your audio controls there for the radio. You've got your Bluetooth, hands-free calling button there, cruise control. Here you got the camera on button for the side view. So you can leave that on at all times don't like that you can turn it off and it'll only engage when you put the right turn signal on. See that? Besides that you have the backup camera system put the car in reverse shows you a few guidelines there telling you where the car is headed so if you turn the steering wheel that's what you'll see. If you want to move the camera down you can do so with this model all you need to do is just push this brown button here I'll show you. There's your top down view, wide view, and normal view. Look at the difference. Do it one more time. Wide versus normal. Here you have your touchpad. Gives you all sorts of information. It's like a miniature computer. Want to listen to XM radio? Go ahead and push it, and there you go. If I pair this up to a phone, you can hit the Bluetooth button and this will this will act as like a dialing pad. Or when you're not dialing phone numbers, it'll act like as a phone book, uh, caller, ID, everything. Everything's on here. If you get the model with the navigation system like this one, you're gonna get a hard disk drive. So you can just put a CD in there and record it onto the hard drive. So no more carrying disk around. Keep your car a lot cleaner looking and organized. Air conditioning system here. It's 
automatic climate control, dual zone by the way. So you can put hot air on one side and cold air on the other side. See that? It's showing 69 degrees on the driver's side, 58 on the passenger side, or vice versa. Down here you got your controls for the navigation system. So we hit nav, it goes right to the navigation system. Got your phone screen. No, we don't want to pay it right now. Information display. Trip computer. And your song zero, information. Zero, one. XM preview. Okay, towards the bottom now, you got your USB connection, auxiliary inputs, 12 volt DC outlet, heated front passengers front driver and passenger seats. Some cup holders there, and some more connections in, inside the center console here. So you can charge your charge your phone right there. Up here you have the auto dimming rear view mirror. Your one push uh, tilt and sliding sunroof controls. Home link. Storage for your sunglasses. You've got your dual vanity mirrors. Now I'm going to show you the trunk. So you have this little latch here, if you need extra space, the back seats fold down flat. There's your matching carpeted floor mats included with the vehicle. Comes with the spare tire and jack. There's your camera. If you buy the EXL model with the V6, you will get these nicer looking tail lights. At night they shine a little brighter and that's because they're LED lit. V6 model will come with the dual chrome exhaust tips. You can get that as well with the sport model by the way so you know. Now we're going to talk about the engine. This comes with a 3.5 liter 278 horsepower engine. For 2013, they call this the uh, Earth Dreams engine. Comes with VCM, variable, variable cylinder management. And what that does, it, it deactivates some of the cylinders when you're driving down the freeway. So it'll maximize the fuel economy. And so you know, this car, although it's a V6, can get right around 34 miles to the gallon on the freeway. Maybe 35, 36 if you press that green econ button I showed you earlier. Located right there. 21 city with the 26 miles per gallon combined. Four-wheel ABS braking system, traction control, this car has everything. All the safety features it needs to accomplish a five out of five star rating. That's the best rating you can get. I'll show you right there. Overall vehicle score, government five star safety rating, five out of five stars. $32,120. Plus fees is the price on this vehicle. And that'll conclude my video of the 2014 Honda Accord EXL V6 with navigation.